Hi, thanks for joining me today. I just wanted to give you guys a little peek at um, how we make our meals around here. One of my favorite things about cooking is having my children help. It's something that we kind of missed out on with the older kids because I didn't really realize how much of an asset they are, how much they can um, participate and help and how fun it is. And um, through that, I've learned too that they learn so much faster and are able to make amazing meals at a pretty young age. It's really kind of impressive. So I'm gonna have you join me today with Edelette and we're gonna make some soup. Okay, we're making what? Beef. Beef soup. So Beef what, are, soup. what are some of the things that we need to get out for that? Don't do that. We need celery and celery. Mm -hmm. carrots. And carrots. And meat. Uh huh. And an onion. And an onion, yeah. Who's going to cut the onion? Mama. <laughs> Why? You don't like to cut onions? Yes, it hurts my eyes. <laughs> All right, what do you need to do first? We need to wash your hands. Move your learning tower over. Might be hot, hold on. Okay. Now, ah, get a towel. Mommy, let me check on the chair. Okay. Now let's get our aprons. Cutting them the size that you would want to eat. Yep. I'll have to help you with the carrots since we don't have baby carrots. I'll have to split them for you first. Okay? Look in that corner. You're looking at. Right. You're gonna finish all your celery before I finish the onion. Peel those so I can get the meat going. Do I have to peel these? Well, they're organic, so you really don't. But I but let's peel these at least. Start with the sweet potatoes. So I can get the meat cooking. So you know we put the some oil in the skillet and we put the onions and the meat in the skillet. Right? Yeah? 
Two stones half. You know where Bandit is? Go grab it. That happens to the best of us. But she's totally calm about it. She's not going to freak out. Uh, let's rinse it off real quick. Huh? Rinse it a minute. I'll get some silver for it. But you will soon. You're already getting so fast. Okay, so eat a lot. What what are you using to cut? Don't put that by your face. What is that? A doggy knife. A doggy knife? It's why is it a doggy knife? Because it looks like a dog, huh? Yeah. It used to have a tail, but that got ripped off. Yeah. There's but, another one that has a tail. Yeah, we have two of these, don't we? Yeah. Why do you like that knife? Because it doesn't cut you. It doesn't cut you, that's right. The peeler might cut you, huh? Yeah. But the doggy knife can't cut you. Yeah. But this one kind of can. But you can still cut carrots with it, right? But you, it can slice up. You can peel a little bit too? Okay, yep. go ahead and cut your carrots. I'm going to peel this one. Do you want to peel? Yeah, they can come back in there. Yeah. How do you do that? <laughs> Keep cutting the carrots. Is it crooked? Yep. Turn it out to go. Mom, that was a long time. I want to make the food. Um, Eda likes making food today. I want to make food. You like to make food too? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. This one. So, Eda, you're using a real knife, so what do you need to do? Try go slow. Cut. And what? And try to not cut myself. Try to not cut yourself? Yeah, that's a good idea. Go slow. Keep these fingers out of the way. Keep your knife paying attention to where it is at all times so you don't stab my arm when I go to grab the carrots. You can put it down when you're moving stuff. Let go. Let go. Set it down when you're moving stuff so you don't cut yourself. Put your little pieces in the blue bowl. And she's mostly eating the carrots. That's okay. 
<laughs> hey, the ones you eat, don't put in the bowl. Good thing it's going to get cooked. Want to race me on mushrooms? Let me show you how I do it. I cut them in half like this. And then I just chop, 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 chop. Uh huh. And then you can lay the flat part flat. Nope. Okay, let's put in, this is ginger. What does it smell like? You don't like that one? Yeah, we just put a little bit. <laughs> yes, you are gonna eat this big thing. You'll get some. And this is turmeric, what does it smell like? You don't care for any of the spices? This one takes a lot. That's good. Stir it gently. You don't want to plop it all over yourself. Looks pretty good. Okay. I think I'm going to stir this. Our soup is cooking now. What all was in it? What's all the ingredients? Um, Ground beef. Ground beef and some potatoes. Sweet potatoes. Sweet potatoes and some celery mm -hmm. and some carrots. Carrots. And some um, onion. Onions. 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 And some mushrooms. And some mushrooms. Rosemary. And some rosemary. Turmeric. And some turmeric. And a little bit of ginger. And a little bit of ginger. And then we put it into stock broth that we... <laughs> Stop! It itches. Broth, broth that we already made. Broth that we already made. And now we're just going to let it cook until all the vegetables are done. Yep. Yep. What about all that mess? <laughs> what? <laughs> You're gonna help clean it up. Yeah. Okay, thank you. All right, let's pray. Father, thank you, Lord, so much for this day, for blessing us with this food. Thank you for the hands that prepared it. And Lord, thank you for just taking care of us, guiding us, and teaching us every day. May we be more and more like you in, uh, in loving you with all our heart and loving our neighbor as ourselves. Uh, thank you for this day, and we pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. All right. All right. Edelette made the soup. So if you want some soup, Edelette has it over there. Ready? 
Mom, do you want me to turn the heat off or not? Yeah, yeah. That is the soup I made. It looks yummy. Mmm, that looks so good. I made it. Can I show the rice for myself? Yes. Show that wooden spoon right there. Yeah, I'm getting yours. I'm getting yours. A little bit more? Oh, thank you. It's a great